Curd's fun to say. Curd, curd, curd. Curd, curd. Hi, I'm Kat and I love my Instant Pot. And I'm pretty sure my Instant Pot loves me, or at least that's the lie I tell myself so I can sleep at night. Let's make some lemon curd. A few years ago, my New Year's resolution was to become really, really fancy, and I think we can all tell. It worked! The first mention of lemon curd was in an 1844 book called The Lady's Own Cookery by Lady Charlotte Campbell Burry. She sounds so fancy. Let's get started on our curd. You could make this on the stovetop. Many people do, but they're just depriving themselves of fancy, fancy time with Instant Pot. It all starts with some eggs. We've got four whole eggs and two extra egg yolks because it makes it prettier and brighter and curdier somehow. Whip, 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 whip. Wanna whip, 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 whip. It's fun whipping things. I'm not working out any emotional demons whatsoever. Just whipping sh Next, we're gonna add a fair amount of sugar. Sugar's fun, sugar's good for you. I've juiced some lemons. It makes me happy to juice lemons. It makes me think of being outside. I haven't been outside for a long time. It's all just fine, because I get to be near Instant Pot, and that's really great and fantastic, and my life means a whole lot to me sometimes. Next goes some salt, because we're not monsters. If you're putting in sugar, you should put in salt. Life is all about balance. What's that like? I've already zested some lemons, but I'm going to show you how to, because it releases fresh, beautiful, citrusy aroma into your house. It's like a window to another world where things can have color, like the sun. Is it still out there, the sun? I remember it a little bit. It's like I'm peeling my own skin off. I never want to do that, though. Happy, shiny, fancy, frothy. My life is not a lie. Next, we're gonna put just a little bit of water into the Instant Pot because this is going to steam some foil so it doesn't completely evaporate, like my hopes and dreams. Pop it in Instant Pot. Instant Pot, you ready? You ready to curd it up? Yes! Instant Pot is ready. We're gonna cook this at high pressure for just one minute and let it naturally release. It's time to release the curd! Just reveal what has happened inside. I have very little sense of self-preservation, so I'm just using my bare hands, but you could use tongs, you could use gloves. I don't care what happens to me anymore. Ooh, it's nice and curdled, but the magic is gonna happen. All of the recipes you see for this will tell you not to use reactive materials like a, like a wire whisk, but nobody's here to watch us. Nobody's here at all. Just Instant Pot and me. No one's here to help. Or yell at me for using a wire whisk. I'm gonna take a little bit of butter. Actually, a lot of butter, because I'm a nihilist. Plop. It's these little things. Make Instant Pot and me so happy. And fancy. My arm hurts. It reminds me I'm alive and still a person. Oh, lemon curd. What the heck do you do with it? You can do absolutely anything with lemon curd. You can slather it on, on various carbs. You can put it on top of yogurt. You can spread it on a cat. You can put it on your skin. You can write help me on the windows with it and see if anything happens when you do that. Um, you can put it on toast. You can pretend like you're the queen at a fancy, fancy tea. You can pretend you're anywhere but where you are. But also, it's great on cake. It looks a little bit loose now, but it's gonna stiffen up in the fridge. One day, I asked Instant Pot what they wanted from me, and they said, everything. So I'm giving them everything, everything seasoning. You're familiar with this from New York Bagels. It's a mixture of garlic and salt and poppy seeds and onion and uh, dandruff and uh, unicorn uh, toes and um, my hopes and your dreams and all of the things that are delicious in life. I thought it'd be really fun to add it to lemon curd. I've given you everything, Instant Pot. Is that enough? Will it ever be enough? Here's everything. It just occurred to me that it was time to go to the fridge and see how the everything lemon curd is doing. Oh, that thickened up so nicely. 
just has a little bit of skin on top that I can stir in there. This lemon curd has everything. Various bagel toppings and hope and deliciousness and sugar and butter. And I'm gonna put it on everything. Yum.